to a little bunny mama. I have a story to tell. Because I'm very stressed out right now. And that's just me. I'm a people pleaser. I can't help myself. And um, okay, class. Next, we're going to chess. And I, d I wanted to be alone at first. And then my best friends came over to me and were like, "Hey, I want to sit next to you." And I was like, "Well, I want to be alone." And that's what I thought. And then they left, and then we sat by myself. And then, um. I was sitting next to this girl, and she was really sad that she didn't have a table group. And the person I am let her sit next to me, and I regret it a lot. She moved her desk, desk next to me, and then this girl came over. I don't know if this girl very much. And she came over, and she just connected her desk. And I hated being my desk, and I switched down, and I was like, she was going a bit, because she didn't get to sit next to me, and, yeah, so then, I saw this girl, my best friend's giving me the stink up, and then when I came out, it was the end of the day, this, her girl, her friend, my friend, that was with the other friend, was like, um, this girl's really mad at you, why did you say you wanted to sit alone and decline our offer, and just go sit with other people? And I knew I would get really distracted sitting next to them. The first person I am, I care about my grades. So I said no because I get to, I, I, just, I, I get distracted sitting next to my friend. That's me. That's just how I am. And I'm a people pleaser, so I felt bad for the girl sitting next to me. And then she just decided to join it. I didn't have the guts to go move because that's rude. I don't care if she's mad at me. She can be mad at me all she wants. And now I'm worried that she hates me. So, hope you guys enjoyed me venting. Next time you see me, I might not have any friends.